Tonight, the old Central Library in downtown San Diego is starting a new chapter, welcoming women experiencing homelessness. CBS 8's Jasmine Ramirez takes us inside to show us how the library has turned to a place where people can find comfort. For years, people have slept on the sidewalk surrounding the library. Now it's been transformed into a place for those people to seek shelter. And tonight, they're sleeping safely inside. This is what the library looks like today. Inside, you won't find rows of bookshelves, but instead, rows of beds. They have a safe place to go. I, I couldn't be happier. Amy Zamudio advocates for those who are unsheltered. Tonight, several senior women she helps are off the streets. Any woman who passes by here in the middle of the night, even if it's 3 a.m., NAMI will be able to give them access to a bed. It is unrestricted. Up to 36 women can seek shelter here and get mental health services through a nonprofit called the National Alliance on Mental Illness, or NAMI. They'll get the mental health component um, that is needed because there is so much trauma associated with experiencing homelessness. It doesn't mean that you have to have a mental health diagnosis, but just the trauma alone. The shelter shines a ray of hope in addressing our homeless crisis. Doing this work a really long time. And through a lot of roads and a lot of hurdles. Ketra Carter works for the city where she helps find solutions for homelessness. For her, the crisis hits close to home. She's been there. I have started in the field. I've been homeless myself. Like, I get this. She's using her experience to make change in our community. I have the pleasure of being a part of the Homeless Strategies and Solutions Program mm -hmm. for the city of San Diego and hold a voice for everyone that wants to tell me what's really going on so that we can make changes like this. And they plan to keep making headway in addressing the crisis. You know I've got your back. And the city says the cost to transform the library and to operate the shelter costs less than $1 million. Jasmine Ramirez, CBS 8.